Hey y'all, hey, it's D. So it's time to go over my financial goals and the progress I was able to make in 2023. If you wanna see what I was able to accomplish, stay tuned. Hey y'all, hey, all right. So it's a time of the year, again, to see what I was able to accomplish in the last quarter of 2023. I did achieve most of my goals uh, earlier this year and I'm appreciative of that. So starting off the year, I wanted to get my mortgage balance down to at least 14K and I was able to accomplish that in the in quarter three. So at the end of the year, I will be ending, at the end of the year, my balance for my mortgage will be a total of 11,000 nine hundred and ten dollars so i am appreciative of everything that i was able to put against my mortgage and yeah y'all um i did have to change my payoff plan for my mortgage and if you want to see that i will have the video linked up above so you can see that and what my goal is but I so i did have to change my plan with my mortgage and yeah y'all it is what it is so i also wanted to save a total of a thousand dollars into my general savings fund and i did achieve that also in quarter three i was not able to save anything in quarter four so yeah y'all did not do that and that's okay i did not want to be really aggressive with any of my goals because i wanted to focus on getting my mortgage paid down and I am glad that I was able to get it down quite a bit. Now let's go down here to the debt payoff form and let's go over what I wanted to do with my debt. So as I stated before, I wanted to get it down to at least 14,000 and I wanted to get at least 80% of this paid off and at the end of the quarter okay at the end of the year my mortgage is currently 83 percent paid off so y'all i accomplished that goal and i am very very appreciative of that and as of my last payment i have a total of 30 payments left on my mortgage according to my mortgage lender so yeah y'all it has been a year to say the least for my finances and this just makes me more appreciative that i was able to accomplish my goals because i did not set up a lot of goals and i made my goals realistic and i'm very very glad that i did do that because it has been a year <laughs> so now let's do a so now let's go over my goals for 2024 i did do a full video on this but i want you I want to share with you my goals for 2024 also within this video so for my mortgage i want to pay my mortgage down to at least five thousand and nine hundred dollars this was originally supposed to be paid off by august of 2024 but because of my finances and how things have been going i changed that to at least pay off about half of the balance that i have left in 2023 in 2024 so yeah y'all and i also want to get to at least 2,000 subscribers here on youtube so if you're not subscribed to my channel, please like, comment, and subscribe and share my channel to anybody who wants to see how I'll be accomplishing and tackling my financial goals on an extremely low income currently. And another goal of mine was to increase my It's D income and I want to get at least $100 a month from those different streams of income and build up from there. Oh, yeah, that is my 
financial goals for 2024 and what I was able to accomplish in 2023. I do have my trackers all set up ready, set up and ready for 2024. So I'm excited for that. And y'all let me know down below what was your financial goal that you were able to accomplish in 2023 that you were most excited about and what are you going to be planning for 2024 so y'all whoo we about to cross into another year and we got to make it do what it do y'all so i'm excited to see what your goal was that you accomplished in 23 and what your goals are in 2024. If you like content like this, please for, don't forget to subscribe to my channel and comment down below to say, hey. And y'all, that's it. We, we're about to go into 2024. By the time you see this video, we will be in 2024. And I wanted to say thank y'all, thank y'all, thank y'all so much for all of, your, all of your support that you showed me in the year of 2023. I did have quite a bit of gains on YouTube. I was able to get 100% monetized here on YouTube. I'm knocking on 1,100 subscribers as I'm recording this video. I received my first YouTube paycheck in the month of November. And y'all, thank y'all. I really, really thank y'all. I've never thought that I would be here on YouTube sharing my journey and so much personal information about my financial journey. But this is a path that I was put on and I am so excited to see where it's going to take me next year. And yeah, y'all, that's about it. So, Whew, y'all, let's get ready because we about to do this in 2024. Don't forget to make the money, but don't let the money make you. And I hope that y'all have a blessed year. And yeah, y'all, we about to go in here and set it on fire. Yeah, 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 yeah. fire. All right, y'all, I'll see y'all on the next one. Bye.